Hello everyone and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. My name is Mallory and welcome to Berry Educational. So today is Sunday and Sundays are usually my big days to get schoolwork done. I am getting my master's degree in elementary education from Western Governors University, which is a full online university and full online program. Um, with that being said, there comes with tests and assignments and all that kind of stuff that you have to do. Um, when it comes to the tests, these are proctored tests. So today I am taking one of my proctored tests. And I wanted to bring you guys along to show you kind of the process for anyone that's unfamiliar with it or to show you that it's really not that scary because I have taken some before. Um, but I wanted to just bring you along. So I have my computer here and I'm going to walk you guys through the process from setting up the exam, signing on, booking your date to getting matched with a proctor. Obviously, once I get matched with a proctor, I will have to turn off my camera and put all my stuff away. So it's because it's a secure testing environment. And then at the end, I will bring you guys back around and show you if I pass the test <laughs> and kind of the process to wrap up a home proctored test. So you want to hopefully see me pass the test. Fingers crossed I don't fail the test. That would be a really <laughs> interesting twist at the end of this video. But uh, fingers crossed I pass the test and um, I can take you guys along the journey. So let's get started. All right, so I decided a voiceover would be a lot easier than trying to uh, book my assessment as well as talk to you guys. So I am just going to do a voiceover. So here you can see me signing in to my WGU student portal. Um, that is where you are going to find the link to sign up for your test. So I, you click on the class. Mine is elementary science methods if you can't see then you're going to go to the assessments tab up on the top and you are going to see that there's a pre-assessment that you have to attempt to take um, before you take your actual proctored assessment so i just showed you that i passed that so then you're going to click on the link that says assessment center and you are going to schedule your proctored test. So click schedule now and then it's going to ask you what time zone you're in. Make sure you book it in the right time zone um, because if you don't, you'll be all thrown off. And then you're going to put in the date and it will pop up the times that are available. So I was going to take it, I wanted to take it as soon as possible, so I picked the soonest time and clicked schedule. So this is the confirmation page that's going to pop up for you and that means your test is scheduled. And then this is the page that you're going to want to um, read over, it goes into all of the different rules and kind of how it's going to work. All right, so as you just saw, I just walked you through the process of um, signing up for your exam. So I signed up for my exam um, and now it is just wait time. So they have a little countdown on the side that shows you how many minutes until you can connect with your proctor. And usually before this, I get my space ready. I get um, a water, a pen, a pencil, anything I need, a whiteboard, um, calculator. I won't need those for this test, but um, in the past I have needed those. So I just kind of gather myself, calm down, maybe look over a couple sections that I'm unsure of um, and just wait to take the test. So let me show you my testing space and um, then we'll get, we'll definitely be closer to taking the test. All right, so I'm not sure how the video quality is, but I turned you guys around so that I could queasily <laughs> easily shut it on and off. So we are down to 48 seconds. So I'm gonna put you guys here, but I need to be able to quickly shut you guys off when uh, the exam is starting. So here we go. 
Let's start exam. So it's launching. Then I'm gonna go connect to Proctor. And now we wait. So they're doing the verification process that I indeed signed up for a test. And then in a moment, a little proceed button will pop up and that is when I will click on it and connect to my proctor. And the minute that button pops up and I click on it means you guys have to be put away. All right, here we go. My proceed button is up and ready and I'm gonna turn you guys off, put my phone away and I will see you at the end of the test. Wish me luck. All right, so I just finished my test um, uh, my proctor, uh, ended the session. So I am out of my secured testing environment. It says great work, Night Owl. You finished your assessment. Please check your portal for the results, which are processing and will be available within the next 24 hours. And from my experience, they are right away. So I wanted to do like a live reaction, live results to see if I passed. Before I look, um, that was like one of the harder tests that I've taken. Um, it was a science methods class and um, like right now I don't feel super secure that I passed. So we shall see. So I'm going to exit out of this, exit out of this, I'm gonna open up my portal and then a minute I click sign in I'll be able to see if I passed and I passed! <laughs> Oh, thank goodness. So go to my assessments tab. And it says I passed, which means I completed that course. I already submitted my task for that course and I completed my OA, which is my proctored assessment. So, whew, yes, that is great news. I hope you guys learned something. I don't really know when, like how this whole video is kind of going to come together. Um, I hope this just kind of eased your, your, uh, anxiety and like questions of how to take a proctored test, um, from home. It is possible. It works. Um, and yeah. Wow. I'm so happy I passed. Cool. Okay. Now on to my next class, which is elementary reading methods and interventions. So Please subscribe to my channel, you guys. Um, I'm trying to post some more videos now that summer is coming up. Hopefully I can um, get back to posting on a regular schedule. And if you have any questions, go ahead and comment below. Um, I would love to hear your guys' experience taking proctored exams from home. Um, and also go ahead and check out my other videos on this channel. There's only a few, um, but they have some good information. And also don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Barry Educational. And I will talk to you guys soon. Thanks everyone. Bye.